What's going on YouTube family? This is Master Music coming with my week 38 Ruin Why Gastric Bypass Surgery update video. On November 15th, 2013, I had the Ruin Why Gastric Bypass Surgery performed by Dr. Lindsay Sharp and Dr. Dustin Bermudez at Rex Hospital in Raleigh, North Carolina. Um, starting weight, uh, actually I was about 415 pounds. I don't count that. I mean, that was, that was like my highest point, but since I started my weight loss surgery journey, uh, highest weight was 402 pounds, which I weighed a week before surgery. Morning of surgery, I weighed th uh, 380 pounds. Today, I weighed 264 pounds, uh, weighed in at 264. I've actually been as low as 262. Um, I've been fluctuating between three pounds. I lose them, gain them in uh, the last few weeks or so. So. Um, other than that, uh, let's see, got a few things to cover. Um, excuse me, it's kind of late night, so I got on my night clothes, and so I'm just kind of looking a little rough right now, but um, it's all right. I know y'all want to see me and see my video. It's been a minute. Um, where to begin? Let's see what's been going on. Um, and don't mind my videos. can be random and all over the place. I uh, didn't really write down a set list. I'm just going to talk and uh, cover everything. Let's see, um, where to start, where to start, um, working out, um, I've been working out, kind of been slack this week, uh, I was on vacation two weeks and I was hitting the gym pretty hard, um, working back, shoulders, uh, doing cardio, doing Zumba like every night, uh, that was a cardio cool down, working all those things, doing the elliptical, rowing, swimming, you name it, I was doing it, so I, you know, that was kind of working it, um, then being out active at band camp uh, with with bands and working with the kids, uh, that kept me pretty active as well. Um, trying to think what else. That, that's pretty much what I've been doing. Um, I still have my 5K coming up October 4th, the color run in Raleigh, uh, which my team, Medical Music, will be running, and I'm uh, pretty excited about that. Um, thinking about doing a neon, uh, it's the electric run in September. We may do that. Not quite sure yet, but I uh, got to get back on it. You know, my knees were bothering me, so I hadn't really done a lot of um, running lately, but I uh, got to get back on that. I mean, running on the uh, treadmill and the elliptical, I've been doing that, but outside, it's been raining a lot here lately, so I hadn't been able to get outside like I want to, and just, it's just been so hot and humid, and I don't, de I don't do heat, call it what you want, I just mm -mm, try to go out, try to find a good time, and with me and my allergies and stuff like that, I just not gonna work, but um, let's see. I'm just gonna go down my list of things. Let me tell you, you know, the surgeon said, told me that, you know, oh, I was reading that hemorrhoids become a problem when you, after you had weight loss surgery, you lost weight. But let me tell you, these hemorrhoids have been breaking me the hell off, breaking me off. Um, never had hemorrhoids prior to when I was overweight. Um, now, I mean. I almost feel like they're going to be the death of me. I, you know, Lord forbid it, but I, I, mm -mm, I, I can't deal, you know. So, I mean, I done did everything. Preparation H, uh, suppositories. Um, I did go to the doctor this week. He put me on some steroid suppositories. They're healthy. And keeping which hazel pads there, that seems to soothe it during the day. But, you know, laying on my stomach with a ramp pillow, uh, I mean, it, you know, it, it's been very painstaking and I don't wish that on anybody. I already did not have a butt prior to when I was big and I definitely don't have one now, skin and bone. So sitting on surfaces like that, is, you know, I'm sitting on a donut pillow now, uh, getting some relief. Um, <clears throat> what else has been going on? Um, I can't really say that I've been on a particular diet, uh, uh, I still get my supplements in. I still drink uh, Premier Protein uh, or Muscle Milk. Um, I get my protein in eating, but I kind of, you know, I have different things. I don't still don't try to do a whole bunch of bread, but I, I have a sandwich. I have it on like whole wheat. Um, BLTs have been my thing lately. You know, I have I eat a half of one and I'm full. You know, two slices of bread and I'm full. Um, trying to think uh, what else and, um, 
don't mind my face. It's just sleep got bad from my eyes. I've been up doing a lot of work, so uh, kind of tired. Um, trying to think what else has been going on. Outside of working, that's pretty much what's been going on with me. Um, I really haven't watched any videos lately. I do apologize. Um, I need to start keeping more up with my weight loss Facebook page. You know, I'm always on the regular one, but on the weight loss one, I, I can't say I forget about it, but I, I do. So I, I need to do better uh, about it. Um, other than that, I mean, everything's been pretty good. Uh, I've dropped more sizes. I mean, even though the scale really hasn't moved, I have been losing inches because I've dropped the clothes size again. You know, I'm comfortably in size 38 pants. And actually, um, I got into a 36 um, recently. So I've seen um, the change and the difference in that. So it's been pretty good. You know, I'm reaping the benefits, you know, losing pretty much almost 140 pounds. Amazing, you know, I'm almost at my goal. My goal weight's 250, the first goal, and so you know, I'm less than 15 pounds away from it. You know, next week will be nine months, and so you know, I hadn't even hit a year yet, so I don't know if I've plateaued out because, like I said, I've been up and down with those same three pounds here lately, and that's kind of how it's been lately. I'll get in a weight class of 10 pounds, and it's kind of like, and then I drop 10 pounds, and I'm there. It's so um, I, I haven't did any significant gaining. Um, it's just been the fluctuation. It just depends on what time of day it is and uh, and uh, and when you step on the scale. Um, other than that, um, if you're just subscribing or watching me for the first time, just check out my videos and you'll see throughout my journey, all the way from getting up for surgery and then rolling in for the table and waking up out of recovery in my room. I, I take you there and end up and you know just watch it um other than that um if you're thinking about having surgery you know like i said it's the best decision i could have ever made in my life i don't regret anything like i said my biggest regret is not doing it sooner when it was presented to me but um just you know good luck to everyone who's having surgery congrats to everyone who's had surgery welcome to the losers bench we keep making plenty of room for you I definitely got room on both sides of me, but um, other than that, you know, I try to come back, make more videos, and, and keep more in contact. Other than that, everybody be good.